back here again with failure racing this week we got our strut tower bar back from tag coatings up in idol falls and so we're going to be installing that and then we're going to be throwing on a new cork sport air filter and then we went ahead and we picked up a filter wears filter wrap specifically designed for these so we're going to try one of those out see if it helps keep a little bit of the water off of the filter but that should be it for this week not too in-depth so let's go ahead and get to it All right, so that goes ahead, that wraps it up. We ended up only being able to do our strut bar. These are actually our external reservoirs. We get asked quite a bit on what these are. These are our external reservoirs for our front dampeners. But that kind of created a convenient place to be able to put them. I mean, it draws attention as well, which is kind of convenient. But that goes ahead, that gets them mounted. You'll notice I only have one on. I actually have completely separate um, clamps from Mishimoto that I need to go through and I need to blacken. I was also going to go through and color change the bodies of them, but we'll save that for another day. I just don't have time this weekend to be able to do it. And then as far as our filter, we, I went ahead, took it off. Come to find out I ordered the wrong filter so I need to order the correct filter. So I was not able to swap that out. I can still put on the filter wares. It still fits, everything like that. I'm just not going to, just because this particular one needs to be cleaned. I don't really feel like putting that on. It's gonna be beneficial when I have that that needs to be cleaned. So that goes ahead, that wraps up this week. Again, we didn't have a whole lot. We were hoping to have our steering wheel in due to the epidemic in the world right now. We were not able to get that in in time. Hopefully we'll be able to this next week, but this week we just kind of focused on maintenance. Now we did do an oil change. That's actually in another video on how to do that, along with how to do a transmission fluid change. So that goes ahead, that sums up this week. Hope to see you again next week.